Hey, what's happening, everyone? I just want to welcome you back to my Train Center series. It's been a week since I re uh, gave an update on this series, but I've had so much things to do with my uh, personal life, so... Yeah, so I'm back with the series and continuing where I left off. Yeah, after that unforgettable Donor Pass mission, which I had to split into three parts, thought I'd take some time off it. Um, so I'll be doing a mission on the uh, oh yeah the Somerset Dorset Joint Railway, and I will be uh, I choose to do this mission the Swift and Delightful episode, in which I'll be uh, driving the Black Five Four Six Zero at three stations. Right, that's it. That's it. Good afternoon. It's a nice clear day. No problems along the route, so just relax and concentrate on your station stops. Before you get used to the route, it can be hard to judge braking distance, but it will come with experience. Good luck. Right, we just need to get our train to get up to speed. It's not even attempted. Look, I've got the air throttle on 70%, and it's not even moving inch. Come on, I want to get going. <sighs> Finally. Right, let's uh, talk you through this uh, steam locomotive. As you can see, we've got this is a steam locomotive. It's not like all the uh, modern diesel and uh, electric trains these days. So yeah, so we've got a couple of carriages. It's a lot harder when you're uh, driving a steam train because you've got to have the. Uh, because you got to shovel like crazy from the uh, tender to the boiler, but not too much in case you uh, have a problem. It's a shame that uh, some steam engines went out, this, out of business really, because I really wanted to see some with my own two eyes. So, for this mission, we'll be stopping at three stations. our locomotive go past. There's a problem with these sometimes because every time I put I attempt to put the speed down Yeah, speed always uh, tends to go up. And there's the best part about using the steam. The steam. I can't get my words out. I don't know why I can't get my words out. Today. Anyway, you can actually put your head out of the uh, of the cab when you're in a steam train. You can actually look forward and backwards, but I wouldn't do that too much in case you uh, get your head knocked off. It's uh, com it's pretty common. In a, a steam locomotive. Well, this is the front end of uh, my uh, Black 5 uh, steam locomotive. Let's go inside the passenger view. Mm, can't really uh, look side to side when you're in the uh, when you're in the passenger view. 
I mean, once again, you can only go uh, forwards and backwards. Don't know why that that's the case. And as you can see, we can go up to 70 miles an hour, so we're going to absolutely floor it to the ground. Absolutely. Now, I can't really go as fast as flying to the one mile hour, but I won't mind that, it's just as long as I uh, can stop my time. That's the other point that we can find on this uh, uh, like. a, I think there's uh, another class of... Um, I think there's another livery for this locomotive as well. It's more of a withered uh, uh, type. Ooh. Sorry, I didn't want to do that. Ah, that's more like it. Actually sticking your head out so you can see where you're going. Right, I'll uh, come back to you when we reach uh, Wing Canton in just a moment. Right, I have approached my first stop at uh, Wincarton. So let's hope this goes well. Right, I think we've arrived there. Yeah, we've arrived there earlier than we planned. Right, once we uh, leave Wincarton, we'll be heading to a platform called Coal. And after that, we'll uh, go towards Ever Creech Junction, and then that completes a short but uh, simple mission. Uh, see how quiet it's gone now that I've uh, actually stopped. Passengers. Board on time, continue to call. Let's bet, let's floor to the ground. Floor it! Oh, come on, this is taking the piss, this. Why does it take so long for a steam engine like this one to get going? I've got the, thro I've got the throttle down at plus 100%. And it takes half a minute just to get it moving. I, I have never had any of this trouble during any of my past missions, like uh, the Donut Pass, which I had to stop at the uh, one and only station on such a ridiculously small platform, as well as the K John Pass, which I had to stop at one part of the line, wait for instructions, as well as the ones in our. As well as the high speed train, that's a lot. Once you've got that up to full speed, it's really hard to slow down at that moment. And it, and it wastes no time getting up to speed whatsoever. Anyway, we're still uh, four miles, less than four and a half miles away from our next destination. I'm coming into Coal Station now. Oh, I'm coming to Pass. I'm going to Pass. That's the end of the bus. But uh, sometime after this station, we've got to go uh, no higher than 45 miles an hour, really. Which is uh, complete of the BS.
Stop, I tell you. Right, so. Once we come out of here, we will only be restricted to 45 before we uh, pick up the pace and head towards Evercreech Junction. And uh, if you can listen to in the background, you actually hear the uh, fireman shuffling call in the background. Just wish there was a uh, way I can uh, actually uh, watch him do his work. Whilst I uh, look back and watch the uh, passengers board. I don't think this is going to bode well, to be honest. Now let's go to the back of the train for a moment. Why are these pat? Why are these platforms so small? Explain that. You're clear to depart for Evergreen Junk. Evercreech Junction. And once again, it takes time to get up to speed. Ah. It, 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 driving a steam train must be uh, pretty stressing. More stressing than a diesel or electric train, though. I mean, the more challenging thing about uh, um, using a steam uh, using a steam locomotive is that the uh, brake distance is uh, more limited compared to the uh, modern uh, diesel electric trains that run on our railway. So you got to be a, a professional at this. Unfortunately for me, I'm twice the opposite. But I'm doing the best I can. Right, so I'm just over two and a half miles to my next, but to my final destination at Everbridge Junction. approaching my final stop now. Yeah, the uh, track up ahead is also limited to 25 because it's the end of the line here. Right, we've uh, passed a couple of trains on the way. But this has uh, been a pretty short for the uh, sweet run. But as the title of the uh, episode says, a swift run at that. Um, I think we've, uh, I think I've decided what mission I'll be doing next. Uh, again, it'll be on this railway. Just listen. That train actually just gone down. We're actually over speed here coming in here. Hmm. Hmm. Our train just coast into the final station. Uh, 
so there you have it. I think I've uh, arrived on time actually. I think this is where the uh, line ends, isn't it? Oh yeah, I see. Um, one, the track I was supposed to be on is uh, going to stop for the rest of the uh, route continues in that direction. Oh, oh, let me do that. So, that, that, that looks like a pretty small route actually. When you come to think of it, I mean the uh, other the modern routes are a lot longer. They usually last about thousands and thousands of miles. This one seems to last only a mere thousand or something. Hmm. What was a bit more challenging was the uh, the style of signals that this railway has. After going with the old-fashioned uh, steam engine, the old-fashioned uh, 60s to 80s uh, signals, which are obviously replaced by the modern. Uh, the modern signals that we have on the main line these days. Well done, you are at your found destination. Every creature station on time. You are ready to do some more challenging jobs, which I will be doing. Uh, so that one went pretty well, shorter than I thought. A really good mission. The best part was having to listen to uh, my locomotive uh, sound like uh, a galloping. A number of galloping horses when it's at its full speed. All right, we'll look at the uh, bruised and battered next. Uh, it's a, it'll be a different locomotive. I'll be using the Seven F Two Eight Black. It's a lot. Sh it's a lot smaller compared to the uh, Black Five Four Six E route that I used in this mission. So um, I'll uh, come back to you yeah, with this mission later on this week, hopefully. Hopefully, I'll add an another route on and uh, do some missions on that, then I'll uh, go back to um, the missions I started with. So, um, also keep an eye out for the latest updates on my uh, new football match to save as well. So I'll see you later this week.